hi guys now welcome back to my channel and right here you can see that i am holding the cola solar generator so to say in this video i want to actually share my experience of using this cola solar generator after more than one month of use i can recall i posted about this about um 14th of april so to say right now i have used this cola solar generator for about a month and two weeks so at least by now i should gain a lot of experience on how this works its battery capacity and the gadget it can power or it can carry and also please this video goes to mr savvy the guy that commented on this video and gave me the idea to make this follow-up video on how this thing works and again please note this video is not in any way a promotion or an advertisement video so to say i am not in any way promoting this product its company or anything about this I'm actually just making a video about this so that I will share my experience to you guys so that those that have in mind to buy this can go ahead or can decide whether or not to get this. Now, this is actually a 1 kVA cola solar generator. So now, 1 kVA means 1000 watt. 1000 watt means 1 kVA. So now, as I said, this is a 1 kVA cola solar generator and what can it power? And Mine comes with a 320 watts panel. Why some oil in some shops? Once you buy it, they will give you 200 watts panel. It all depends. And I bought this cola slash for 360,000 naira. But I know of some guys that bought theirs at uh, different shops for 400,000 or more than. So to say, it depends on the shop you are buying it from. So you can now, even without the panel, you can use it because you can charge it with both nepa or solar panel but mine ever since i bought mine to be sincere i have never for once used the panel to charge it before because this thing serves me very well it doesn't always in fact it doesn't run down ever since i bought it because i'm using it like very very well okay now let's come back what can this one kva cola solar generator power okay now when i bought it the first time i made some experiment to see how it lasts that's to see its battery capacity and please take note this thing comes with a lithium battery so to say it has very strong battery now on my experience on how this thing works there was one day i charged this thing fully with nepal light when i charge this fully now i say okay let me run a test on this you can see this fan here this is my fan this fan is actually a 92 watt um aux powered fan so to see this fan is very very powerful but there are some other fans that come with 50 watts not as much powerful there are some 10 watts there are some 20 watts all depends on the capacity of the wattage of the fan so this fan here is an aux fan if you have this fan at least you know how powerful this fan can be it contains or it has 92 watts so it means that it has a big coil at least now when I charge this solar fully and I plug this fan that contains 92 watts on my phones because I don't really sleep early. Once I sleep 10 p.m. in the evening, it means that I sleep early. So that day I charge this thing fully and plug my fan on my phones 10 p.m. and I slept. So I woke up um, 6 a.m. in the morning and when I woke up in the morning, I saw that this thing, the fan was still on and this thing was still on but it was, it was only remaining one percent battery you no know, all in total it contains three bar here but when i woke up 6 a.m in the morning it, it was only remaining one percent bar so it means that it was still working so now if you calculate to plug fan alone and your two phone because i use iphone 12 pro and also a techno phone so to check to plug only your fan here your aux fan and two phones from 10 p.m in the evening to 6 a.m in the morning is about eight hours so because this thing was not down so it means that probably or approximately if you plug your aux fan alone on your two phones you can power like nine hours or maybe more than okay so that was the first test i made about this and there's one thing you should know before buying this color large generator first of all have in mind of the purpose of buying it for me i'm a content creator so i need an extra power backup because you know in nigeria light is not always constant so whenever i want to make video or whenever i feel like i should make video and there's no light i should just come and 
on this and make my video without any hassle or stress so for you if you are buying it to power your fridge and your ac then know the kind of kva to buy this is a one kva so don't buy this one kva and expect it to do magic and power everything in your house it's not possible so now when i meet another um test about this you know this fan this us fan contains high watt so the higher the wattage the more the gadget drain more battery of this now for like iphone 12 pro you know iphone 12 pro contains about 12.5 or 11 watt battery so it means that if i should use only my iphone 12 pro and plug on this color solar when fully charged this color solar can charge my iphone 12 pro like more than 50 times before it runs down so it means that if i charge the first time i use it it runs down i come again and charge this cooler solar can charge my iphone 12 pro for more than 50 times before it runs down i'm telling you based on experience so also please note you know because i'm not a promoter or an advertiser of this anything i tell you about this is the truth the whole truth and nothing but the truth it's only advertisers or sellers that maybe can overhype this to entice you to buy this but for me i'm just making a fair review and experience based on experience of using this color solar generator now as i said know the purpose of buying this this color solar from my experience i will rate it 100 over 100 because it is saving my purpose based on the money i bought it it's actually worth buying but the money is actually worth buying seriously it's worth buying okay now you know a 50 inches high sense smart tv contains let me say roughly about 60 watt or 120 watt depending so now if you plug your 50 inches high sense smart tv with this cooler solar when fully charged it can as well save you like eight hours or nine hours because the smart tv and this fan contains almost the same watt understand so it means that if you have smart tv fan and phones to charge in your house you can go ahead and buy this because it will save you but if you check some review online they will tell you if you charge it fully and plug your tv it will take for 28 hours no it's not it's not like it can't last for that i don't know about this but if you want a higher capacity then you can go ahead and buy 2000 watt that's to give you that one is more costly than this and that one can carry your fridge and probably inverter one horsepower ac now also I also made a test with this on my fridge. I used um, a 90 liters high sense fridge. So there was one day I made a test with this on my fridge. And to be sincere, this thing was able to power my fridge. But the one thing you should know about this is that it's not about being able to power your fridge. You know, to start fridge, fridge has a such that is called startup power. Once you on fridge, either with NEPA or with inverter, before the compressor starts, it consumes more energy. And that surge can consume up to 300 watt to 400 watt. So since this is a 1 kVA, it was able to power my fridge. But just that I don't use this on my fridge because I don't want my battery or the battery threshold of this to get weak. Because I bought it for my content creation, my gadget, my fan, my studio light, my phones, my laptop. It is actually saving my papers. And to be sincere, ever since I bought this solar solar generator, I have never for once charged it with my solar panel. Because ever since I bought it, I usually charge it with light. And before it runs down, there's always light. So up to now, my panel is there in the kitchen park. I've never mounted it on the zoom because it saves my papers. And now again to be sincere when you charge this fully as a content creator that was at home let me say you want to plug your laptop your phone and set your light this thing can save you for even two days i mean with constant usage like charging your phone laptop not fan i mean like to exclude fan it can save you two days or more than like gadget like phones and laptop and maybe studio light though depending on your studio light anyways mine is a led 600 um pro studio light and it contains um very low wattage so if i use it on my phones my laptop and studio light it saves me even sometimes more than two days so overall 
This Cola Slash Generator is very, very recommendable. So if anyone is going to buy it for his own uh, personal use at home as a content creator, I would advise go ahead and buy this Cola Slash Generator. But however, if you are buying it to use it for your fridge, please buy the 2000 watt, otherwise called the 2 kV. That one can power your fridge conveniently without any stress or hassle. And also it can power your um, one horsepower inverter AC. Understand? So guys, what again should I make review on? What again? You can see mine is remaining only one percent. So this one, like when I charged it last, it was about um, let me see, four days. So I have been using it constantly to charge my. For ever since I bought this thing, I don't even care about Nepa. Nepa allowing you coin, like making no coin, no concern me. I use Nepa only maybe like if I cook food or like to get my drinks, my food and my water in the fridge frozen. Or sometimes if I really heat, I'll just on the AC and use Nepa. So apart from my fridge and my AC, I don't even need Nepa right now anymore. Because this Cola Sola says my papers 100% and I will always give it 5 stars anytime, anywhere because it is actually saving my papers. So guys, um, I don't know what else again I should make the video on. So if you have any question in the comment section, please ask me. In case I forget anything, I'll be there to answer you. So overall, this Cola Slash Generator is very good and recommendable, especially as a content creator, because you can always take it anywhere you are going to. Let me say if I'm traveling to some remote areas to make videos, I can use it. And also you can power Starlink conveniently. So you can take it to your village with that network, buy Starlink, power it, use it for many hours, also for POS uh, business people. In fact, it is good. In fact, this thing can power, this one gives you can power an inverter fridge conveniently because that one contains low energy and the such power to start the compressor is not as high. So if you have, um, if you have um, an inverter fridge or like high sense inverter fridge, this one KVA can power it conveniently without stress or hassle. So guys, overall as I've said, this 1000 Cola Solar Generator is worth the money. It's worth buying. It's good. I like it. I love it. It gives me goosebumps. <laughs> so for now, I don't know. Any question, please go to the comment section, put it there. And thank you guys. See you guys in my next video. Bye.